Okay, so welcome back. And now we're going to do an example, and I'm going to show you how these are coterminal sides or coterminal angles. Okay, so what does coterminal mean? It means that the angle, they, if we have multiple angles and they're coterminal, means that they end at the same spot in the Cartesian plane. Okay, so here we're going to go uh, 390 degrees and 30 degrees. Well, where's 30 degrees? Well, let's say 30 degrees is right here. Okay, so let's say this is 30 degrees. Right, so here's 30 degrees. Now, if this is coterminal to 390, I should be able to go a whole distance around and come back, which means I should be able to add a whole revolution, which is 360 degrees. So if I add, 360 degrees all the way around to 30, what do I get? Well, 390. So if I add 360 to the 30 degrees, I come all the way back and I get 390 degrees. Okay? So also notice that if I subtract 30, I get 360 degrees, which is one revolution. Okay, so now let's do another one. <clears throat> let's do 180 degrees. So 180 degrees is this one. Okay, that's 180 degrees, right? So here, 180 degrees. Now, if I add, again, if I add 360 degrees, I'll come right around full circle. So 360, so 180 plus 360 is what? <clears throat> 540, right? Mm, not quite there. So what if I have 360 again? What if I go, what if I keep going around? Well, let's go one more. So 540 plus 360, ah, that gives me 900, okay? So also, so basically uh, if I keep adding multiples of 360, right? And if I can get there, or, or what if I subtract, what if I subtract 180, what do I get? Well, if I subtract 180, I get 720. Well, that's a multiple of 360. That's 2 times 360. See, see what's going on here now? Okay, now let's do this one. Let's do negative 150. Well, negative 150 is where? Over here somewhere. Right? Well, that's actually pretty good. Okay, so that means um, from here, right? So here, clockwise, is negative 150 degrees. Okay, now, again, if I add, if I add 360 to this, if I go all the way around, I add 360 to this, what does that give me? That gives me 210. Okay? So again, if I add 360, I get 210 degrees. Okay? <clears throat> Incidentally, that's 30 degrees. That's why I was like looking at that. I was like, yeah, that's pretty darn good. Okay. Okay, so that's what it means to be coterminal. So if one angle is a multiple of another, or excuse me, if you if you have to add or subtract a multiple of 360 to get to the angle, then those angles are coterminal. 
So again, to be coterminal angles, you have to show that one angle, to go from one angle to the next angle, you have to add or subtract a multiple of 360. That's it. See you later.